Okay, we're back. We're actually here at the Mariposa military base. Lily's been tortured and uh, all her belongings taken from her. <laughs> in fact, uh, she's locked here in this cell. I think with Ian was here. Oddly enough, they didn't take anything from him. So, uh, it's not as bad as it could be. I think he at least has some of that Brotherhood armor. Motion scanner. These are all these grenades. Alright, a firearm, the radio. I think she's gonna take all the stem packs. Motion sensor. Alright, apparently you can't use the uh, radio indoors. I think we're gonna see if we can rest. Oh, motion sensor. There we go. Forty-four. Forty-four. Oh, it must be a mismatch of ammo. Hold on. Yeah, all right. Okay. And uh, it looks like next door is Sarah. I guess another prisoner. And here's a super mutant. Ultimately, she'd like to escape with her belongings. Obviously, this is locked. And uh, report back to the Overseer that uh, the Master, I think, is at the Cathedral of the Children. Must have not been a very tough lock. <laughs> Alright, so I think uh, talking with his other prisoner. Where's Ian? I think he's set to walk further away. Okay. Sarah. What are you doing out of your protective cell? <laughs> of course, she has no belongings. It's like I was telling her that we're just uh, walking around. You should be in your cell. The guards are keeping us here for our protection. The robots have been programmed to attack unescorted normals. Once I've been dipped, I'll be able to spend time helping the Unity. <laughs> I think she's surprised to hear that she's eager to uh, help the Unity. Of course! It's the best chance human humanity has to survive. Alright. <laughs> it's been uh, practically brainwashed. Well, that's interesting with the robots, then. Perhaps we can maybe program the robots to, uh... ...target the mutants, or to shut them off altogether. Here's more mutants, look at that. Locker, look at that. Wouldn't be surprised if uh, her stuff is in there. I hear something terminal.
You do not see a control panel on this emitter. Perhaps there's another way to lower this force field. Force field. Okay. Sciences. Seven. Okay. I think before we try sneaking past uh, <laughs> this huge mutant, we'll at least look where the elevator can take us, I think. Alright, we're on the third floor going to the fourth. Man, there's a robot. Mr. Handy. Sounds like a utility robot, though. A foot locker. Man. I don't think we want a chance uh, having to fight three mutants and a robot. I think we're looking for uh, a computer terminal. All right, sneaking around the corner. All right, here, this looks like a forest field. Children of the Cathedral Technician. I think that's where Lily wants to be then. They're gonna like call call the guards. No. Oh, look at this. All right, here are uh, vats, <laughs> which you can recognize from the uh, previous movie. All right, so speaking with the technician. <laughs> I surrender. A green screen display monitor showing various bits of data. A few bytes occasionally show up. Please don't kill me. I only work here. You wouldn't want to kill an unarmed man, would you? Alright. So all the technicians are uh, standing down. You hear over the loudspeaker warning intruder alert. Computer. I don't know if guards are coming. Actually, the important computer looks like this one with two working displays. Well, actually, that one has two also. You try to use the computer, but unable to get any useful information out of it. Man, 